What's up, everybody? I'm back playing some Madden 25 Ultimate Team, and this time I'm playing in the fan game. Now, let me explain how this came about. Um, I was looking for a new quarterback because I'm tired of my Andrew Luck legit getting hurt in every single game. Every game he gets hurt. So uh, I took to Twitter, I asked, what quarterback should I get? Because I got a little coins to play around with, as you can see up there. I was thinking about either the Ghost Cam or Randall Cunningham because that's about the price range that I could fit. So someone hit me up, this guy here, Mr. Miracle Man, and he said, I don't even like this game anymore. I'm about done with it. I'm just going to play on my farm account. You can have my ghost cam. Now me, anytime someone offers me something, nine times out of ten I either don't see it or I don't accept it or just almost ignore it. Um, and one of the main questions that I ask as we found our way through the hole on that one, one of the main questions I ask is, are you finished with the game? Got him, Cole. We didn't catch that one. I always ask, are you finished with the game? Are you sure you don't want X, Y, and Z? Because I just don't want to, you know, accept something from someone and they, you know, it might be a, a big part of their team or something that they can't afford to give away. Like, let's say they have a ton of these cards, but they don't have a lot of coins. I want to make sure that they're secure and giving it to me. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that quarterback rap with Walter Payton with the stiff arm. So, you know, that's that's just kind of how I am when it comes to someone giving me something. I want to make sure that they have all the coins that they need and all the cards they need so that this won't hurt them. But if you ain't playing the game no more, hey, who told you to pitch that ball out? If you ain't playing the game no more, I'll, I'll, I'll take it. I'll go on ahead and dig it. I'll take it. Why not? It makes my videos better. So let's get into this game. So uh, he made the fatal mistake of giving me his cards before the game as he gets a fake punt with Ben Roethlisberger and he gets it. Ah, uh, the humanity. So he made the mistake of giving me the cards before we played. Now, granted, I'm only playing with about three of them. I'm playing with the Reggie White. I'm playing with, oh my God. I'm playing with Brian Arakpo and I'm playing with the Ghost Cam Newton. I don't think there's anybody else that he gave me that I am playing with. But it left a huge hole in his team because his quarterback is now Terrell Pryor. And that's not going to always be good. But I got Scram Ass Newton down. You guys have been booyah. You guys have been wanting me to play with Scram Ass for the longest. For about two years now and I never have. So I'm going to do a full season of Scram Ass Newton. Ah, look at that dot. That's one thing I noticed about this Cam. He throws dots. Uh, but I'm going to play a whole season with Cam. I, I already started. Look at that. Got him, coach. He didn't see Golston at all. I already started the season. I'm two games in. And I was two games in before I got the Cam. Gave it right back to him trying to force it to Mackie. For a... Uh, or a pretty cool catchphrase if it ain't Mackie and ain't me. Hopefully I get a chance to do that. Hold up, we got a dot on the way. Look at that. Good God. In stride? I felt good playing with this scram. I felt real good. How does he get that pitch off? I felt, look at that. I get blocked by my own, my own man. I felt real good playing with this cam. And I'm looking forward to playing with him some more. And I'm, I'm back on my attempt at a road to the undefeated Super Bowl thingamajig. And if Scram is the one to get me there, ain't that going to be a bitch as we get that sack. Look at that. Look at that. For some reason, not too many people have figured out uh, how to beat that play that I'm sending. I uh, send a lot of guys there. Look at Mackie. Look at Mackie. Finding his way. Who's calling me while I'm doing the commentary? I'm not interested in that call currently. As we hit the out route to Alshon Jeffrey, and he got busy in this game. Now he got going back to Terrell Pryor. Nice nine yard game. Up the middle to the refrigerator. William Perry gets the first down, even though we was there to stop him. I thought I held him, but I ain't gonna hold him up too long. And T.Y. Hilton absolutely annihilates Richard Sherman. Annihilates him. There we go. We're pressing again. This time he takes off with I was about to call him Scram Mad. But he takes off with Terrell Pryor. Picks up a first down. This time we're playing off of T.Y. Hilton. He bombs it on the scene to Deshaun Jackson and gets a first down. So he's looking, he's looking, and he finally gets in the end zone. I could have sworn I picked that thing off, 
but we didn't. We didn't get the shutout that I was looking for. Now he sends that edge heat. We're going to go on ahead and pitch it this time around. Hollywood gets tackled on the heat seeker. I swear. Sometimes I dislike it, but I guess it's to counter the overpowered offense. Look at the back juke. I'm working on it. I'm working on the back juke. We're going to get it. Don't worry. And this time we find Mackie, but not in the end zone. Ugh, let me use my catchphrase. But Alshon Jeffrey, once, once again, this guy is clearly player of the game material in this game. He's just always going to find. Oh, look, look at Sherman getting burnt again by T.Y. Jeez. On fly routes. Just. Ugh. I'm pressing. Sherman has a really good press and just got. Uh, uh. And now he's about to get right back in that end zone again. We meet him in the middle, but we get blocked outside of it. I just, I just don't know. But we got about four seconds left. I'm going to heave this thing up there. Look at this. Look at this. Cam puts it right on the money. And Alshon drops it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next video.